What if I told you that the world's most advanced fighter jets are already flying, but almost no one outside the Pentagon in Beijing truly knows what they can do? What if I told you that the United States and China are not preparing for tomorrow's war? They're preparing for a war that could begin tonight, high above the Pacific, in skies where no radar dares to look? And what if I told you the most powerful weapons of this hidden arms race are not missiles, not bombs, but ghosts in the sky? Jets so secret, so lethal that even their names were locked away until now? So here's the real question. Who moved first? Who holds the advantage? And when these invisible giants finally clash, will it be the American phantom or the Chinese dragon that rules the battlefield of the future? For years, people wondered, when will America reveal its sixth generation fighter? The US Air Force stayed silent, only dropping hints through the NGAD program, next generation air dominance. That silence ended on March 21, 2025, when President Donald J. Trump, alongside Defense Secretary Pete Hegseth and USAF Chief of Staff General David Alvin, announced Boeing's selection for the NGAD contract. The centerpiece of this program? The F-47, a fighter jet designed for battles we can hardly imagine. But here's the twist. America was not the first to show its hand. Just three months earlier, in December 2024, China quietly tested not one, but two mysterious prototypes, one of which became known as the J-50.0. What exactly is the F-47? Some call it the Phantom of the Pacific. Its design is tailless, stealth-optimized and engineered for long-range missions, not just a fighter, but a battlefield commander. Imagine a jet that doesn't just engage in dogfights, but controls swarms of loyal wingman drones, blinds enemy radars, and projects power thousands of kilometers away. This is not just a warplane, it is a force multiplier, built for air dominance in contested battle spaces. But such dominance comes at a cost. Experts estimate 250 to 300 million dollars per jet, making it one of the most expensive aircraft in history. So the question is, if the F-47 is so costly, can America build enough of them to truly tip the balance of power? Or will it remain a rare jewel unmatched in strength but too few in number? And here's another twist. According to USF projections, the F-47 could enter service between 2025 and 2029. But analysts warn that full deployment may not arrive until the early 2030s, as advanced engines and supply chains catch up with the vision. Now, let's cross the ocean. The J-50 is China's latest answer to American air power, also tailless stealth-optimized and future-ready. But unlike the US, China isn't chasing the perfect gold-plated fighter. Instead, Beijing wants a jet that can be built fast in large numbers and at half the cost. Analysts predict a price of $120, $150 million per unit, almost half the F-47. Does that mean the J-50 is weaker? Not necessarily, because China plays a different game, quantity over perfection, mass deployment over exclusivity. So here's the riddle. Which wins? The jet that is nearly unbeatable but rare? Or the jet that may not be the best individually but comes in overwhelming numbers? The F-47 and J-50 are not just fighter jets. They are two blueprints of future war. America's F-47 is like a scalpel, precise, lethal, and unmatched. Built to slice through any single battle, it represents the belief that superiority comes from perfection. China's J-50 is different. It's a sledgehammer designed not to outshine but to overwhelm. One may not defeat the Phantom alone. But what if there are 50 dragons in the sky? So what happens when precision meets numbers? What happens when the Phantom of the Pacific faces the Dragon of the East? Will the F-47 carve its name into history as the ultimate air dominance weapon? Or will the J-50 prove that in modern war, quantity can become its own form of quality? And here lies the most chilling thought of all. Perhaps these jets were never meant to fight, but to haunt, to circle in the shadows, to signal that war is always one heartbeat away, one radar lock away, one political misstep away. Because if they ever do meet, not in theory, but in the skies, the world may wake up to a new era of warfare overnight. The F-47 and J-50 are not just aircraft. They are the opening gambits in a new arms race. 
one that could decide who commands the skies for the next half century. But the question that keeps every strategist awake at night is this. Will the skies of the future be ruled by a handful of elite invincible American phantoms, or by an endless tide of Chinese dragons rising faster, cheaper, and in overwhelming numbers? One represents perfection, the other represents persistence, and history shows sometimes persistence wins. So as these shadows prowl above us, one truth becomes clear. The skies are no longer silent. They are whispering of the battles to come. And when the day arrives, the world will look up and finally see which vision of war prevails. The race for the skies has already begun. Every day, a new piece of the puzzle is revealed. Miss one update and you fall behind. Subscribe now and stay one step ahead of history.